Los Angeles and we're here shooting the Allure cover which I'm really excited about. It's their 20th anniversary cover and I love the magazine so I was really excited to, to be doing this. The whole feel of the shoot is about kind of soccer mom, a little take on that. Going to football, into baseball, but a little more on the edge. As this is the 20th anniversary cover, I've been asked what my hair and makeup was like 20 years ago. You know, seriously, it was absolutely bloody awful. But what I like to say is that everything was good at the time. And it's all been relevant in making me who I am and how I dress and how I wear my hair and makeup now. Well, the thing is, Victoria is kind of like a fashion icon also. So it was exciting for me. It's the first time I meet her. And it was nice just to try to play with her hair and try to do something a little different. On the hair, I just did something very simple, just a little volumizer on it. Just gave a little bit of bend with a curling iron. Quite sexy, kind of bedroomy, without being uh, overly done. Always the key with this kind of hair is not to overload it with product. I wanted to reshape and do the eyebrow much stronger, much stronger because she can handle that and it gives her like a strength that she is good with. Take away the what? The lines? No. The lines? I mean, good God, I'm 36, I've got three children and I'm very stressed. And you can capture that. That's fine, that makes me look real and accessible. Okay. The only thing that changed style-wise when I moved to the US is I, I bought a pair of Ugg boots, but I don't get photographed in them. What makes me feel most beautiful? My husband makes me feel beautiful, my kids make me feel beautiful. It's good being the only girl in the Beckham household.